Okay, are, are you familiar with the name Christopher Beck, Chris Beck? Chris Beck? Um, mm-hmm. No, I don't really know who that is. Okay, he was a Navy SEAL. He is a Navy SEAL. Mm-hmm. Who, uh, about 10 years ago, he transitioned. Um, so a and female? Now he, excuse me? He transitioned to a girl? Okay. Yep, he he's a, he he was a male, a, a navy a navy seal, and he transitioned to a female. Now he's detransitioning, and he's, oh, he's leading this campaign, essentially saying that America it, it's almost like a, a mill, if you will. Um, soon as a kid says, "Hey, I'm a little confused," they, they have uh, doctors and psychiatrists are telling them, hey, you're transgender, go. And he said almost within a week, he had a conversation that he was confused and he was on hormones. What do you think about or do you know any um, transgenders who has either detransitioned or in or in the process? Of I, knew of one. I knew of one a long time ago when I was younger. Um, I remember her name. Her name was T.S. Eve. Um, she was gorgeous and she took her breast implants out, all that, and went back to, it was weird looking though, because she looked still real feminine. She's looked, even when she went to turn back to a guy, I still was like, I see a girl still, like, it's weird. Like, I'd be like, why would you do that? I kind of looked down on her because I'm like, why would you do that? So yeah, I knew of one, but I mean, it happens, I guess. People... I don't ever see myself doing that ever. But do, do you feel like America or or the society as a whole are pushing um, teenagers into? I mean, because we, we're seeing teenagers younger and younger who are transitioning. Uh, their parents are, are actually being applauded for being mm-hmm. understanding, you know, accepting. And, and you know, many times these they're teenagers. Mm-hmm. You know, who knows if they are are gonna feel like this two, three years from now, but they start a transition. Yeah. That's yeah, that could be a little tricky when you start that young. But mm-hmm. I think, you know, usually in my opinion, when it starts off that young, they know exactly that's what they want to be. But you know, some people like Caitlyn Jenner that started at 70, 60 years old. That might be a little different, you know, because I don't know. He could very much say, I don't want to do this no more. But at this point, he's old enough. She's old enough to know, like, this is it. This is who I want to be. But come on, you waited this long to transition. So that should, you know, just it's a little bit much. I think if a person on transition, they should start young. Let's look at somebody like Dwayne Wade's daughter, Zaya. Mm-hmm. She came out at 13 years old, and I believe she's in the process now. I believe she's 15 now, and she's in the process of transitioning. But, you know, even if she wanted to turn back, there's so many cameras and so much uh, of the spotlight that's on her at this point. How, how do how does a young person even turn back once they say, this is who I am and what I want to do? And then everybody starts pushing them in that direction. Yeah, I do believe that that is. Uh, I have no fucking idea moment <laughs> for me because I don't even know how that would even work when that happens because it's different for me. I didn't have all that. I did Correct. it all myself. You know what I mean? It's a little different for her because she's in the spotlight at that age. So it's like now she and maybe in her mind, she has to keep doing it, you know, Correct. even if she wanted to, she probably couldn't. And it's like she'll probably make a lot of she probably feels like she'll make a lot of people disappointed, you know, in my opinion. But I think it melts my heart that they are supporting her. I think it's amazing. Like, no, I, I think it's a beautiful thing that they're supporting. Her. I, I do. didn't have that support. I didn't have that type of support at that young. So it, it it came for me when I when I got into my when I got out of high school, when I became and started into my 20s, you know, I had to wait a little bit. So I'm a bit jealous of her. 
I'm a bit jealous mm-hmm. that she has that, that I, I wish I could have had that that young. But the thing is, I hope she don't have no thoughts to wanting to go turn back because it's like you here, girl, you got to keep this going or it's going to be a lot. It's going to probably be even more controversial, you know, so. Do, do you think do you think it should be an age limit put on this or, or, or an age where you can actually start to transition no different than voting or um, going to war? getting a license do you think that you maybe the government should step in and say okay you know what if this is who you are at 13 you'll be this person at 18 but at mm-hmm. least you'll be a little more mature and and you'll know that this is something i absolutely want to go through with instead of making a decision when you know we probably wouldn't let most 13 14 15 years old 15 year olds make life altering decisions. Uh yeah. I don't think it should be an age limit. I think you don't um, I think if this if a person if a, if a child feels the way they are you have to accept that at that moment. I don't think it should be an age limit. No. I think I think it is we know when it's you know, I think we know when it's the right age. Like, okay, this is okay. Maybe I would say the I would say the probably the youngest, probably I would say to take it there is at least eight, eight years old, nine years old, maybe ten. Yeah, I mean that's I think that's, young, I think that's the youngest you could do it. I think that's the youngest we could entertain it and is at is it at 10 years old because I think around that age that's when People can a child can really know in a way what they their mind is in a way. I feel like, yeah, anybody under nine years old, you shouldn't even know what sex is or even liking what is. But I mean, nowadays, you never know. It's so much going on. There's kids see everything now. Kids see stuff they shouldn't see. So but I still don't agree it should be an age limit. I think it's. I, like, I, I, I think ten is young, though. I, I would say you have to be a teenager at, at least, least at the bare at least minimum. Twelve, thirteen. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, and even that to me is young. But you know, mm-hmm. it, it, if you got your parents' consent, but I'm even worried about that. Like you know, we we have all made this. In your case, you knew exactly who you were at a very young. Age. I did it myself. I did. Nobody was helping me. Yeah, but but it, you knew who you were. Mm-hmm. But there are a lot of people take sexuality out of it. They, they have no idea what I want to do with my life. They have no idea, you know, about most major life decisions. It's, you know, even as adults, they still are trying to figure it out, let alone being adolescents. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.